Drive Road has just updated, so let's check it out. Heading into game, you can see that we have three new cars, the first one being the Cyber Volo, the second one being the Jupiter GTR, and the third one being the Pioneer. And we can now paint our garages, invite people in your server to your garage, new limited time bundle, which is the Cyber Volo, Sunsets are back again, the Pioneer is a new dealership car, and then there's new weekly missions, which give the Jupiter GTR. Once you're in your garage, in the top right, you'll see this paint button, and if you click this, you can select the different paints you want to get. I'm not exactly sure how this works, but we'll figure it out. And if you go into the visits tab and invite, then you can invite anybody in your server into your garage, which I think this also allows you if you have it set to nobody can go to your garage, you can invite someone and they'll be allowed in. And in the bottom left, like we've seen the other packs, if you click on this, you can see the Cyber Volo bundle. This is 1,199 Robux. And in this pack, you'll get the Cyber Volo, you'll get glowing cybernetic tires and cybernetic exhaust and backfire trails. And if you go into settings and scroll all the way down, you can see that you could finally set it to sunsets again. So if you like the way sunsets look or you want to take pictures at this time of day, you can now have the ability to do that. And this used to be in the game a while back when they had a day night cycle, but this caused too much lag and they had to remove it. But luckily now they've added it back. So if you want to take pictures, you can do that now. And it also creates a pretty interesting atmosphere whenever you switch to rain or storm. And this will feel like it was back in the Halloween event. And now if we head into shop, you could see the brand new car, the Pioneer, and it's $200 and $70,000. And here are the customizations on it. And we also have a brand new race called Rapid River. And since it's a new week, we have new weekly quests. And completing these all, you'll earn the Jupiter GTR. And to start off, I'll show you the 10 parts in the USA map. Starting up in the top left, head over to Sawmill right here. And right in between these trees and bushes, you'll see the part. For the second part, head over to this race right here, Sawdust Sprint. And right on this path, you'll see the part. For the third part, head over to this trailer delivery spot right here next to Drag Strip. And right on top of this dam, you'll see the part. For the next part, go over to Turbine Turmoil. And right in between these trees, you'll see the part. For the next part, go over to this trailer delivery spot right up in Mountain Town. And in between the gas pumps, you'll see the part. For the part all the way out in the desert, head over to this race right here, Canyon Run. And down here next to the trailer, you'll see this part. For the next part, head over to this trailer delivery spot right here. And right down here, you'll see the part. For the next part, head over to this race right here, Skyline Speedway. And right here, you'll see the part. For the next part, head over to this food delivery spot right here. And right over here, you'll see the part. And for the very last part, head over to this spot right here, car wash. And right behind this building, you'll see the part. And with that, let's grind the rest of these weekly quests so we can check out this Jupiter GTR.
Well, uh, I don't think this is supposed to happen. I have a built-in lift system, I guess. It's perfect for checking out the bottom of the car. All right, I completed all my weekly quests, so let's claim them and check out this new Jupiter GTR. And here are the customizations on it. Unfortunately, a lot of the spoilers don't work on it. As you can see from this angle, this spoiler isn't even attached to it. And that's the same for a lot of these. So for this one, I definitely recommend just keeping the stock spoiler. And here's the Cyber Volo, the new car in the pack. And these are the tires you'll get for getting this pack. And this is a nitrous effect with the different colors. And this is a backfire effect. So if you like any of this, you can pay 1,199 Robux and get all of this. And on top of this, it's only available for one week. I'm going to start off with the dollhouse. I guess I'll just buy this and see what happens. So the way the paint works is you'll buy the pack and then you can select whichever one you want. And from here, you'll select the group you want to change. So for example, I'll just want to change the lights. Then I can select the material that I want to use on it. And you can also open up every category and select specific spots. So for example, I just want kitchen and for this, I'll just pick this purple wood texture and heading into the kitchen you'll see that the lights are purple but uh <laughs> this doesn't look very good uh i think i will change this let's buy this greenhouse one for this one you get a whole bunch of green textures the next one we have is beach day a beach day a offers sandy textures and blue textures so if this is a style of garage you're looking for you can buy these next we have the showroom materials i think this one uses all the stock textures for the showroom garage so if you want to test out different paints and then go back back to the original ones you can always buy this one and then change it back later the next one we have is golden valley nature a which are the textures you can find out and around the map so if you want your garage made out of grass then uh i guess you could buy this one and do that on to the next one we have volcano a which is a whole bunch of red textures the next one we have is the mechanics garage materials which are all the materials used in the mechanics garage we have realistic lighting which i think these mostly are just for the lights up here so if you're wanting to make a different atmosphere you can buy this and change the lights and then and it'll change how the room looks because I don't really think it changes the floor or walls at all. And on to the last one, which is 175 gold. This is life in a luxury A. And it's definitely a flex to buy these and use them. And here I'll show you what all the textures look like so you can make your mind up on which ones you want to buy.
There you go. There's all of the different types of paints. And this isn't the best way to showcase them. The best way is just to buy them and test everything out because this offers a whole bunch of customizability. And with that being said, I think I'm going to go and start working on actually painting this garage. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this update, and I'll see you in the next video.